Welcome to Watch Cards Daily Security Byte. I'm Corey Nockeiner. Today's story is Apple targeted phishing. Today, I just have a real quick story for you. According to 9to5Mac and a couple other media sources, there's an increased number of phishing uh, emails uh, or a phishing campaign that seems to be targeting renewals on the Apple App Store as well as iTunes and their music application as well. So the example given is, uh, say, an email you get that looks like a YouTube Red renewal. As you might know, YouTube Red is an extra paid for it option you can have monthly with YouTube. So you might get an email asking you to renew your YouTube Red subscription, but at a crazy fee, like $144 rather than $14.99. Now, of course, this particular phishing email actually doesn't even care about your YouTube renewal. It's not trying to get you to spend $144 on the App Store, but it is attempting to get you to click the link to cancel your subscription because you think that's just too much money. Now, of course, if you, you click that link, they're going to ask you for a whole lot of personal information, including your App Store logon, to try to steal that information for you. It's a relatively simple and common phishing uh, scheme, getting you to click a link and, and input a lot of personal information. But it is interesting to see all this uh, targeting to Apple's uh, App Store ecosystem, as well as ones that are trying to prey on renewals in the particular App Store. In any case, if if you get one of these emails, the most immediate tip off is probably the email address. You know, Apple emails will come from a specific apple.com domain, as well as hovering over the link will usually show you some signs. And uh, organizations like Apple won't actually ask you to enter all this information after clicking a link. By the way, this is a big enough issue that Apple actually posted a support update talking about how to avoid these sorts of phishing emails. So if if you want more information, check that out. That's it for today's story. Thank you for watching.